What's up, pro shooting coach Colin Castello back, and today I'm gonna give you Steph Curry's secret shooting weapon. All right, so Steph is obviously one of the best shooters of all time, if not the best shooter of all time, but he's got a few things that he does on his jump shot that you can do on yours that will instantly help you increase your shooting percentage. So the first thing is what we call flow, right? And flow basically just means that the ball moves at the same time through the body and into the shot. And so the whole key here is that you want the ball in your body moving all at the same time, right? So if my body's moving down, the ball's gonna move down. If my body's moving up, the ball's gonna move up. You'll notice that the ball is always connected to Steph's body, right? Very rarely is the ball gonna move up while his body moves down or the ball moves down while his body moves up and it's this collapsing of power and extension of power that really kind of takes it to the next level increases his range and his fluidity on his jump shot the next step secret is his tilt now a lot of times players are told that they need to square their feet on the jump shot right or maybe one's like a little bit closer and it's staggered but if you notice Steph always tilts his feet just slightly as he gets ready to shoot and what that does is it unlocks the shoulder muscles up top and allows his elbow to easily get underneath the basketball so everything's nice and straight. A lot of times when players square up to the hoop, they start to bring the ball up and it naturally either pulls their elbow out this direction or they have to pull the ball up the opposite side of their body to be able to get it, right? And that's gonna be out of alignment. So try tilting your feet just slightly and that will help out a ton and I promise you, you will instantly hit more shots. All right, a little known Steph Curry shooting secret is what we call an eye trail. Basically meaning that when he lets the ball go on his jump shot, he actually follows it up with his eyes and down into the basket. Now this is something that a lot of players are told not to do by their coaches, right? They're told, hey, lock in on your target, fire it up and then stay locked on your target. The problem is a lot of times this kind of screws with the natural momentum of a player's jump shot. And sometimes I think that Steph does this eye trail to essentially kind of line the ball up and it's the last kind of point of release, right? So it's one of those things where it's not the end of the world if you don't eye trail, but you might wanna just try it and see how it works for you. And if it's working, it might be something that you don't wanna break when you're training your game. So just think about letting the ball go, follow it up with your eyes, and then back down to the hoop. All right, now I got something for you 100% free. If you wanna shoot like a pro, the guys over at Pro Class have put together a shooting pack to help you maximize your shooting potential. So all you gotta do is click the link in the description down below, pick that up 100% free, and you're gonna be working out and shooting with guys like Damian Lillard, Kyle Korver, even Tyler Harrell, among a bunch of others. So to get that 100% free and train like a pro, go ahead and pick it up today. Also, if you're new to Shot Mechanics, pop the like button, it helps us out a ton, and hit the subscribe button, ding the bell notifications, all that sort of good stuff, because it all helps us out. Because we put out the best basketball videos on the internet, and they're all gonna help you get better. Until next time, splash on.